Yes, it feels so good to be back in normal mode once again. Definitely an easier level than the first two, but it didn't come without its struggles. I give the Haunted Ship of Fools a 3 out of 10. Here are the big difficult bits here. Of course, you have the birds at the end of the level. However, you also have the ghosts at the beginning of the level, as well as navigating around the Durons. Their hitboxes when they draw their sword are deceptively large, and sometimes you have no choice but to wait it out, even if you're doing a speedrun. But that lightning attack I'm falling in love with already, and I believe it will help me out a ton in the bullshit that is to come in this game. But 3 out of 10 is all I can give the Haunted Ship of Fools. 
Next up, we are going to be visiting the Tower of Terror.